Okay, can you bend your knee up on your heel? Here we go. Hurt now? Is it alright? What does it feel like? Okay, feel too bad. Okay. Did it hurt when you first did it? Or? Yeah. Yeah, mine was probably worse, eh? <laughs> in our muscles, you know that's where they're located, and every time you move, they're, they're located in, the amount of them are per square inch, so you might say, all right, right here there might be 220 pain receptors per square inch, and over here 180, they, yeah, yeah, they jump all over on you, and why is this, if it's closer to an artery or something important, there will be more pain receptors there to let you know, hey, this hurts more. Get away from it. Yeah. yeah, because you could hurt them. Man's chest hurts. Get a tattoo on your chest up there. More pain receptors there than anywhere else in your body. My cousin's boyfriend has one on there. He has like really over. Oh yeah, they super work. nice tattoo. But uh, okay. he said he wanted to quit. I got you. Oh, I bet. There. Yeah. You used to do. You don't say nothing. <laughs> you know, like I've been there so many times where you're just like, you're just ready to, that's it. But you won't say a word, and you'll take it for two more hours. And you'll just sit there and take it, and it's all done, and you go, God damn, I don't know how I did that. But you, it don't get any worse, it just gets a, uh, you gotta be disciplined to that uncomfortable feeling. You know, instead of always trying to have your way get comfortable, you gotta just surrender. You go, okay, I mean, it's not gonna get worse than this, but it's just gonna get continuing. Same shit. Oh, that's why I always come in and see that time. Well, that's letting fate run its course, too, isn't it? You got one of those universities, too, on his arm. I don't know about that one. <laughs> yeah, a lot of guys will get that whatever those different uh, symbols are that you guys have, you know, like um, fraternity houses. Oh yeah, stuff like that. I've done a lot of that. Yeah, it's good memory. Yeah, I guess. But so is this stuff too. Like, I mean, say you and the boys all in school together, go out and uh, you're all skiers. Yeah. Well, you know, it's just good to go to the ski chalet and have a wild weekend and take a bunch of pictures, and you'll always have them as memories, too. Oh, yeah, definitely. We don't ski, though. We snowboard. That's what I mean. That's an important thing. I got to get used to that, because I'm a skier, and I skied all through Europe. All the best of them, man. Any, you know, all those quality places in Europe, I skied them all. And at that time, I was interested in snowboarding, but they wouldn't even let snowboards on those hills, man. They still don't at one. At some, but most of them are like the time Okay, cool. And I used to feel sorry for them, because it was only like Tuesday morning, a fat cat scratch. It's a tattoo yeah. feeling. Yeah, it's a tattoo <laughs> feeling. Yeah, you can't, you can't explain it. You, you, you feel like it's like vibrating around your leg or like what is it? It's just, no, it's just your body pushing. I don't know. Oh. What are you it has a very unique sensation. It's like a burning 
irritating, cutting, scratching. <laughs> this thing's moving about 4,000 times a minute, and it's going in and out of the skin that fast. And because of that, there's a lot of heat generated. Yeah, it's kind of like one of those little pinches. Yeah, those little... And the burn together. Yeah. Excellent. He just got that done like two days ago, didn't he? Like yeah, like like Thursday or something. Yeah. Hey man, when you have to get 30 bucks from out of the bank, because my bank will only let me take out more than $100 at my actual bank. It won't let me take it out from the Bank of Montreal. Oh, God. So where's your bank? $100 is your interact limit? Yeah, well, because it's got $30 gold. It's 12 and I got a tattoo. <laughs> That's cool. I worked in a tattoo shop since I was 12 years old. Really? Yeah. That, that's pretty cool. So did you know that was a tattoo artist? Canada's oldest and most famous tattoo artist. Who's that? The oldest family in Canada. Pat Martiny, out of Edmonton. And then from Pat, I ended up with Jerry Swallow, apprentice. And Jerry Swallow is the oldest. You know the guy that was on Jenny Jones? Yeah. yeah. I mean, the guy with the, Tom. Yeah, yeah. What the puzzle piece nice do? Tom. He's a real nice guy, too. Like, really nice. Where would you recommend to go get a piercing at? Blackstar. Yeah, they're good? The only ones in town I tell you to go there. Yeah? Yeah. You, well, I know this. You're going to get surgical implant grades. You're not getting 316 to 304 or 306 or free machining. You're getting real implant grade jewelry, which is meant to go in the earth. Say you, uh, you had an operation, you had that pins put into your hip or something like that. That's what they're throwing you? That's what they're throwing in you. Same shit. Re the real McCoy. So, you're so that's why more. you're paying the more bucks for the you're jewelry there? You're more because you're getting the best jewelry. That's cool. And I know the guy who makes it. You know, I know Roger. I don't, you know, I don't, I'm not partners with him. I don't get no money out of this business. But like, I, I, I'd be honest, you know. I don't want people going somewhere in town where it's not clean or whatever. Mm -hmm. So Black Star, I would recommend it. In this city, is the best here. Now, there's always, you know, like, if you get pierced there, Roger's the better piercer, too. I'm not saying don't you let anyone else do it to you. Yeah. Where Kathy is the better artist in this shop. This means she's a better tattooer. She's a better artist mm -hmm. than I am. Yeah, because I'm thinking about getting something done there and probably like get Roger to do it. Yeah, Roger, he's very good at it. He's very, um... Yeah, and, and he coddles the fuck out of you, though. You know what I mean? Treat you like that. Blah, 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 blah. It goes over everything. Yeah, everything is yeah. really important. But well, that's that good, though. It's very good. But yeah. some guy doesn't want to be coddled. Get on with it. But he's no way, man. He goes through the whole scene with you. And, and uh, so much you be rested. Because I wanted to get up and leave. Yeah, you know, he I said, well, that's for a reason. You know what I mean? I think we're just about there, buddy. Right? A few little blank spots for that. Damn, nice tattoo ass. Looks looking good, man. You saw him, he's the one who did it. <laughs> That's a damn good tattoo job. <laughs> That's what I actually feel like, huh? Well, it vibrated here. <laughs> it's a real hard thing to explain, man. Yeah, we were talking yeah. earlier. I've actually gone to uh, hair clippers now. There you go, yeah. Shaking on your head. Really hot and pinching. <laughs> yeah. Pinching hot hair clippers. Yeah. Those dull ones that they don't put oil on. Yeah, yeah I hear that. So I get my hair cut, you know, every week. <laughs> <laughs> get shaved real short. I hear you're going for your nipple today. No, I was thinking about it, but I can't decide on what piercing you got. It's either tongue, nipple, or septum. Okay. I oh, mean, go for the nipple. I just I don't know. Septum's though, cool, but it can get ugly, man. I don't know. But you can hide it. I'm it's thinking, pretty cool. Yeah, like, I want something that I can conceal. Yet, Roll still have. Yeah, like, I could, I could, if I use the curved barbell, that one burns, eh, Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you missed a painful shot. There's some spots, like, seriously, like, the middle part right yeah. there, the line goes down. Like, what's the, less pain, the least painful part of the body of a tattoo on? 
probably your outer leg and your outer arm. Yeah. Least painful. Is that a pretty painful slot right there? Or? Ah. Not too bad? One, not the best, but it's... Chest was it. Chest is it, yeah. That's what he said, yeah, before. Chest is it, yeah. Yeah, gonna be yeah, the other thing about the nipples is, I don't know, because like snowboarding and skateboarding. Oh, you'll rip that motherfucker off your yeah. yeah, that's that's what I'm wondering about. <laughs> Big time. That's why I'm thinking you the nipples hit that will be fucking, bad. You hit that snow on your chest, uh, you'll be ripping <laughs> that thing right out. That's what I'm thinking. If you take it down, would it do anything? Or no, no? you'd be okay if you take it down. Yeah? Because you get some pretty hard balls, and you're going over like just rough terrain on your chest hardcore. Exactly. So. Everybody look over at it, man. Yeah, well, Well, I not I know Jack shit. <laughs> What I want your opinion on giving you all my bongers in there. You're what? You got fucking Captain Crunch in the bong. I got Ryan McDonald on the bong. I got fat uh, Teddy in there. You can smoke too, huh? I got mine on back. Right on, right on. That's fat. Yeah, not during work though. Not even let me. Hey, do you know you can get some good seats? <laughs> um. Yeah. Oh, I didn't put it on. I got some. Dude, yours aren't that good. I don't know, I want super potent seeds. Maybe even a fast blooming plant if I can get it. Right there. What do you got to hold on to? It's a cup, well, because I almost passed out. I really? passed out, but I just got like, right, right when you first started doing it, I got really lightheaded. Yeah. And then yeah. they gave me some chocolate and some water. So chocolate. what's, what's yeah. that right there? Yeah. It takes a good apprenticeship <laughs> program. Mm -hmm. takes two to three years before you'll even touch the gun. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So yeah. at first, it's really important that, that you don't, because if you get them into it right away, you'll lose us and fire them. Yeah. Who's there to fix the fucking thing? Yeah. Nobody. Nobody. So you're gonna, it's gonna get red, it's gonna get irritated, and what your body produced for it to heal has now been... Wiped away? Wiped away. So, in the next two hours, the body is gonna secrete Okay. Within this ointment, all of its own sebum, which is its antibodies to help heal it. Leave those workers work all night long. Tomorrow morning they'll be oh, tired of working and they'll get the job. Okay. And what they're doing is any dirt that wants to try to get in there, fuck you. They're like, come on. They'll kill anything trying to get into the system of your body. So you wipe them all away, anything can just walk on in and say, hey, I'm going to protect myself here. Simple, That's what we're learning in biology right now. Are you? Yeah, about the T and the B cells and it's, stuff. It's really simple, guys, all this stuff. It's like you think, oh, you know, that's pretty hard. That, yeah, it's very simple. We got people from my dad's door to sign it, too. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't even know him. Universal. Sweet Shirley. <laughs> Shirley came. I'm gonna sign some anonymous names, just whatever. Yeah, She's hot. Do you like the card? Happy tattoo. Happy tattoo. Center of attention. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep this one for sure. <laughs> Knew you'd like it. And it's got a monkey. That was Paxton's idea. He picked yeah, it out. The monkey. I think. The monkeys like it. Yeah. Everybody likes monkeys. Yeah, monkeys are rad. I really like my monkeys. I stay in the car. If I had three wishes, I'd wish for a monkey. Oh, yeah, you had said that to me. Did you? Yeah. And then pass them to them that they were journey animals and they throw food. They all the time and then they threw their shit And then they whack off? Yeah. And then we compared it to Pax. Thanks a lot, man. Let you down. Oh, yeah.